Good morning, everybody. We're in Radisson, Saskatchewan. We're going home today. So that's exciting. Ooh, we're one of the last ones in the lot here. Makes sense, because we were one of the last ones to get here last night. So let's quickly get this truck ready for the road. And let's get out of here. We're about 900 kilometers from our yard. I'd say about 550 miles. It's gonna be a hammer down day today. All right, next stop, home. Probably at least one or two in between here and there, but only for the necessities. This is the home time day. This is the come home day. Last day of the trip. Every other day we try to drive to conserve fuel, which means driving slow. Today we're in the left lane gang. Today's objective is to get home as soon as possible. And that's the only objective. in Winnipeg, just on the west side, coming into Headingley. The scale's open, just to finish off the trip with a woo! Trying to get home.
not too much because I want my I want to fill up on next month's pay. One kilometer, turn left on Oak Forest Crescent. So I'm at an eighth of a tank right now. I'm just gonna put about 100 liters in, or like 50 gallons. Where is an opening? In 100 meters, turn right on Cat Manitou Road and then turn right in 70 meters. Saw this guy's brake lights come on, so he must be done. Yep. Lucky me. And there we go, safe and sound. Right where it should be. We've got ourselves all unhooked. Got my tarps along with me. Land the gears down, get the wheels released. It's time to go. Well, it was a good trip. We started out here, went to Victoria, BC. Went up to Edmonton, Alberta, and came back here. Well, Meadow Lake, Saskatchewan, to pick up that lumber, and then back here. it's time to go home it's nine o'clock here so my kid will be in bed already by the time I get there but we'll go to the shop get old blue put away get it all ready to be safety got to bring it to the shop uh, day after tomorrow hopefully it doesn't need too much these safeties are uh, something we've got to do every year and it can get pretty expensive Hopefully not much needs to be done. It's gonna be an expensive visit though, that's for sure. We got the safety along with the full service, along with the polish. It's uh it's gonna be one of those days. That's the sound I'm gonna make when I see the bill. I know already. Back home, old blue. That was a good trip. Went to see the mountains, went on a boat. That was fun. This zero turn mower is sold. Next week, a buddy of mine is coming to pick it up. So this whole area here will be free and clear, which means I can probably move the bike against there. And all of this is being taken to the garbage. So this whole area here will be nice and open, which will be awesome. I'm just getting all my stuff together, trying to get everything into my pickup as quickly as possible. It's already 10 p.m., so I've got to rush home, quickly shower, pretty much just jump straight into bed. So seeing as I haven't been at home with my family and my wife for a while, so I'm going to end this right here and get everything in my pickup and go. Take care, everybody. Drive safe out there. Keep it between the lines. Keep the shiny side up. Keep the rubber down. Keep your stick on the ice. Keep your eyes on the road. Keep your phone out of your hands. We'll see you tomorrow.